folks in part of the Texas Hill Country resting easy tonight after firefighters were able to 100% contain a wildfire that quickly grew into hundreds of acres. That fire first broke out in Llano County earlier today along Highway 29 between the towns of Llano and Buchanan Dam. KXAN's Lindsay Bramson joins us live from the scene out there with more. Lindsay? Good evening. Firefighters tell me it was a very intense afternoon out here for them that is actually still going on at this hour. I want you to take a look behind me. You can see that firefighters are still on scene here. Nearly 500 acres caught fire around 3 o'clock this afternoon. I'm told this all started as a result of a dump truck catching on fire that was parked on the side of the road. Now, you, flames apparently, because that truck was just right on the grass there, parked right there, as soon as it caught fire, that fire just quickly spread. Again, we're talking nearly 500 acres. Now, the good news is it took about three hours, and they did have the fire 100% contained. Nobody out here was hurt, but there were several animals here that were at least 200 feet away. No people were out here, and I'm told the extreme temperatures plus the high winds is what caused the fire to move so fast. Now, again, keep in mind, this is just one of several brush fires we've had here in Llano County just within recent weeks. Again, you can see behind me, firefighters are still out here on scene. We're pushing about six hours now, and they're combing through the woods back there and through the grass just to make sure that everything is safe before they head out for the night. Reporting live in Llano County, Lindsay Bramson, KXAN News. And back here in Austin, firefighters had to put out this grass fire along I-35 between Wells Branch Parkway and Grand Avenue. Traffic in the northbound lane was delayed for quite a while. Firefighters were able to put those flames out quickly, though. No word yet on what sparked that fire. For the first time in a decade, members of the military are helping to fight wildfires in the U.S. Several states have called in their National Guard. 200 active duty soldiers are now being trained as firefighters and will be sent to help over the weekend. In Idaho, firefighters captured this surreal scene of fire NATO. It shot flames up to 100 feet into the air and dropped hot dirt and ash on the firefighters below. 